Wow, Molin is actually red right now. We're down at 1.2%. Uh, but if you saw my last video, I talked about a bullish engulfing candle, right? And it's starting to look like this is actually what happened because right now we do have a green candle even though we're down. Guys, I'm gonna show you this, but before I do that, don't forget to drop a like. Truly appreciate that. Think about subscribing if you're not subscribed yet. Molin has been on a roller coaster ride. It is Friday. I'm grateful to be here with you another day. Um, and I wanna just give you my best. I wanna give you my honest opinion on what I think really Molin is gonna be doing right now, what we're waiting on. You know, it's gonna be a quick, short video, but we all know we're waiting on the, the news with Lawrence and Molin and MAEO. And supposedly it's supposed to be today, but they haven't released any news yet. So I, I'm not thinking it's gonna be today. I, I don't want it to be after hours, even though maybe some of you do. I would prefer it to be pre-market on Monday. That would be great. You know, I think if we can close green today, that would be a solid sign. Now trading um, at 73.59. So if we can close green, that's positive to me. I don't wanna break 72. I let the Patreon know this morning that our, our base, our floor was basically 72, just under 72 actually, but we have strong support there. It's looking really solid to me that Mullen maybe has bottomed out. Maybe, right? But you wanna be aware that we do have an all-time low of about 68, so we can retest the low. We really need to build a base, we need to build a higher low from here, and then we can consistently make our way back up. Now, if we do get the news we're all looking for, then this thing can rock it. This thing can go higher than even 80 cents, 90 cents, even a dollar. I've given you my price targets on what I really think Molin can do if the right news comes out from MAEO or from Molin, but right now it's a waiting game. So it's Friday, we might have to wait a long weekend. They might not release news after market closes today. We have about 15 minutes left of market being open and you gotta be okay with that, right? You gotta go back to your conviction why you invested in this stock in the first place, why you invest in any stocks in the first place. Of course, none of this is financial advice. I'm not an advisor or anything like that. This is just my honest opinion. And the second thing I wanna talk about is Tesla. Tesla is ripping today. We're up almost 4% on the day. I first let everybody know that they should be buying Tesla when I bought it back at 173, 177, and now we're sitting at 214. But if you wanna know why I bought it back then and really what the charts were, were telling me, Join the Patreon down below It's $7 till my birthday at the end of this month, and then it's gonna increase from there, right? But this weekend, I'm gonna be making a bunch of chart videos, a bunch of technical analysis to really, you know, give everyone a bunch of information ready for next week. So get in while you can. Back to Mullen now, we actually just went positive while I'm making this video, we went green, so that's good news, right? So it looks like this could be the start of a run. And I think right now, we're, our volume for the day is about 14.9 million. So we got 13 minutes left. This could get crazy the last 10 minutes. You all will probably see this video after market closes today, but I'm feeling very good about Mullen stock right now because I do think we're gonna get news. And if you saw my video this morning, they were talking about class one, class three vehicles and really getting that into businesses, the commercial businesses where the money is. So that's something we can all look forward to in the future, especially with production beginning in July. It also looks like Molin on Twitter is marketing their Molin 5. Uh, you can actually reserve it now. This is kind of weird because they pushed this back, I thought. So I don't know. I don't know what news is coming out. Molin is a big question mark right now, but I am anticipating some solid news and I'm anticipating for this stock to run, being my own opinion, of course, right? Because of everything that has been built up and the sell-off that has been happening the last couple months, it's time for this thing to turn around. So what do you guys think? Do you think that some news is coming out for the Molin 5? Are they gonna start production sooner because they just pushed it back? Do you think this stock is gonna be a green week next week? Do you think we're gonna get news from Lawrence and Molin at MAEO? I hope you have a great Friday, have a great weekend. Thanks for watching and we'll see you on the next one.